everybody, it's Chris and I'm back with another haul. And this haul is going to be a lot of shoes and some clothes that I picked up over the last couple months. So let's go. All right, so to start things off from Target, also known as Target, <laughs> I picked up a pair of pumps. And these are these burgundy or maroon, they're kind of like faux suede Marona pumps, all right? So I had to have these, okay? I don't know where I'm gonna wear these, when I'm gonna wear them, but I had to have them. Um, you know, I've been wearing a lot of darker lip colors now that it's colder outside, so I'm gonna find a way to work these into my wardrobe, okay? I'm gonna be stepping somewhere. <laughs> also, what caught my eye, since I'm a taller girl, I kinda like to wear um, heels that are not necessarily like ridiculously tall because I'm not trying to be like towering over everybody. So this heel is like a couple inches tall, it's perfect. Perfect for what I'm comfortable rocking on the day to day. So it says that these are called Natasha and the color is burgundy. Um, so I got the eight and a half. Um, I'm kind of like in between an eight and an eight and a half sometimes. Usually I go up like a half size or so, maybe even a full size sometimes at Target. Um, sometimes their shoes run a little bit small. These fit just fine and they are gorgeous. Yes, gorgeous. <laughs> So not long ago, Boscos was having a buy one, get one for a $1.99 sale. I was in there, it was crazy busy, y'all. Like, it was like so hectic in that store. Um, but I made out with four pairs of boots and I'm super excited. Since I've been down for the count for a while, since I had my wisdom teeth out and I was kind of jacked, I haven't really been filming as much. Um, I've actually kind of like been able to wear some of these out so I can let you know about like comfort level and stuff like that. So um, the first pair of boots I have here look like this. All right. I also got these in an eight and a half because I wasn't sure how thick of a sock I was going to be rocking. They're also really cool because you see the angle here. They come up a little bit higher in the front. They also have like a zipper here that opens halfway so that it's easier for you to get your foot in there. These are just adorable. They're faux suede. And okay, I'm going to show you the bottom, but it looks like I have some Leo hair and some Chloe hair up in here. So just kind of ignore that. But the bottom is kind of like a, um, it's got kind of like that suede material on the bottom too. And then you have like the rubber sole at the back. But these boots are like one of the most comfortable pairs of boots I have ever worn. Seriously, um, the brand is, they're called Rampage and I got them in a size eight and a half medium. They came in a big old giant box like this. For real y'all, I was like by myself at Boscov's and I was, carrying around because I didn't have a cart. Boscovs, at least the Boscovs around here, they don't have like a lot of carts. They have like four carts for the entire store and I did not have a cart. So I was like carrying four big boot boxes around trying to like try on stuff and trying to make my way through the store. It was a mess. But anyways, <laughs> all right, so don't yell at me. I got like three of the pairs of boots are black. <laughs> so okay, it was really hectic in there so I definitely just wanted to make sure that I got something that I knew would match with everything so I got these flat boots here for a dollar hey <laughs> one dollar and these are cute they have like tape on them apparently Let's wipe the rest of the tape off but these are kind of like a leather like material um, so the reason I decided to go with these is because obviously the other ones are suede and you know if it's like deep snow outside I'm probably not gonna want to rock those uh, but these I will rock in the snow so the brand here is Rampage and I got a size 8 in these boots and it's called Fixter so you can see that they're not too tall they kind of come up like mid calf and they have like a zipper detail on the side the same as the other suede boots and they're really really comfortable so so the next pair of boots I have is not black it's brown okay so I fell in love with these when I saw them um I've never had a pair of kind of like boots like this combat boots I guess you want to call them like that <laughs> And I've actually rocked these a couple times and they're ridiculously comfortable. These boots are from a brand called Wanted. Looks like that. I got these in a size eight and a half medium and they're called Recruits. So let me give you a little bit of a tour on these boots. So the laces are definitely functional, so that's cool. They also have this detail here in the back, like it's got like a zipper that is also functional. So you can kind of like rock these boots in several different ways. Then it has like this faux wool material right here, which I just thought was adorable. It's like a dark gray color, perfect for the winter time. These here actually snap like that. So you can rock these, again, in so many different ways. You can wear them all the way laced up. You can fold them down. You can slouch them down. So cool. <laughs> all right, so the last pair of boots I have here are not really like fancy or anything, but they're really good for like walking, but you want a little bit of height. If that makes sense, that probably didn't make sense. But I got these boots here, and these are crazy comfortable. Crazy, cushiony, comfortable. So again, I don't really think that these are like all that fancy. They have like this little, design here 
but I didn't really get them for fanciness. I got them for comfort, okay? And also for times when I don't want to wear like a flat boot and I want some height to kind of lengthen the legs a little bit. Um, <laughs> so I thought that these would work out pretty good and I've rocked them several times and I absolutely love them. So this brand is called Life Stride and it comes in like a box like this. I'm not sure if you can see that. It's kind of like a glare. But I ended up getting these in a size eight and a half medium and they're called, um, it says Hand Black Test. I'm not sure which one is the real name, but Hand Black Test. <laughs> also are really easy to get into because they have the zipper here just like that so they have a whole lot of cushion inside so it definitely helps like if you have to walk long distances and things like that the bottom is like a really nice rubber sole and it says flex and the heels are harder rubber so there's not like a lot of pressure when you're walking these are not like loud shoes like you know how like you wear shoes that are like they're just loud like you know you coming a mile away because you can hear you clicking and clacking these are not loud at all so that is just fantastic i don't want to be clicking and clacking down walmart <laughs> down walmart's aisles and stuff so all right so i just want to show you guys a couple tops that i picked up um some are from the goodwill as you may know like i am in love with thrifting as a matter of fact the shirt i'm rocking today it's kind of like a sweatshirt it's like really warm um but it looks like this and this shirt is like brand new for real. I got this shirt for two bucks, okay? So I am totally a Goodwill haul girl. So I usually post my Goodwill hauls on my blog. So check that out if you want to see, you know, previous tops and dresses and, you know, shirts and shoes and things like that that I have previously purchased from Goodwill. So this top may look familiar. Um, I was actually rocking this in the holiday hair updo um, Shea Moisture Jamaican Black Castor Oil line video. Long, okay? But I actually got this top from the Goodwill and I love it. It's from the White House Black Market and it's kind of like silk stretch. You know, the beading detail up here is just really pretty along the neckline. So again, it was like a couple dollars, like four dollars or I got it when it was like a buy. Everything was like 50% off or something like that. But either way, it would have cost me a lot more, okay, from White House Black Market if I bought it. Full price. <laughs> This is another top that I recently just wore. I also got this from the Goodwill and this is an express sweater and it's got like the cute little flutter sleeves up here. But again, how much would an express sweater cost if you bought it in the store? A lot more than $2. Again, it is like brand new. Why not? <laughs> and I think that this color blue is like perfect with my skin tone. So yes, do not sleep on Goodwill. <laughs> But my casual days, I found this top from the Goodwill, and this is from a brand called Caslon, and I've never heard of that brand, and I really am not like over the top, like brand conscious. So like I will wear something even if it's like not a known brand, it really don't matter to me. <laughs> but I thought that this was cute. It's kind of like really wide and slouchy. It's got like these perforations. I hope that's right. But it looks really cute with skinny jeans and those gray boots that I was rocking in one of our vlogs. So yes, this is still cute and casual mommy on the go type shirt. <laughs> And last but not least for this haul, I purchased a Vera Wang top, which looks ridiculously busy here. It looks really busy. Um, I don't really wear like a lot of prints, but when I tried this on, this looks so cool. So I had to get it. This top looks really cool on. It's kind of like a, it looks kind of like a stone pattern. And it's got like, you know, gray, purple, blue, kind of like matches my eyeshadow and stuff like that. So. I fell in love with this print and I'm going to be rocking this. I'll probably put like a sweater over top of it on days when I'm feeling kind of like, I don't really want to wear a lot of print. <laughs> a lot of the Simply Vera um, Wang shirts and dresses and stuff like that have a lot of like, you know, different brush prints and like they look like artwork. So that one was actually one of the more toned down pieces of from Vera Wang. So I'm actually going to enjoy wearing that. I'm going to be rocking it. Y'all probably see it in another video real soon. <laughs> With that being said, this concludes this shoe haul, boots haul, slash clothing haul. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If so, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more videos. And I will see you very soon in another one. Take care. Be sure to check out my channel homepage for lots more to watch. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more. Have a great day.